Hey everyone, my name is Tegan and welcome to Tandy Writes. And today I'm going to tell you about my first novel, Beauty and the Breakdown. I should have probably got this out to like wave it around earlier, but here's my book. It's available on Amazon and Amazon only right now. Here is a fake Polaroid from Berlin, which I'm using as a bookmark. When I was seven years old, I started writing my first stories, which were finding a more creative way of learning my spellings. Writing a book was the only thing I wanted to do with my entire life. So many years and many more short stories later, I finally finished writing my first novel called Beauty and the Breakdown. I decided to self-publish it through CreateSpace, which is an Amazon company, at the age of 15, so I had full control over what the appearance of the book looked like, the interior, like including my writing playlist at the end of the book. And since then I've been offered a publishing contract, which I unfortunately had to turn down because of the £2,400 which I won't stop mentioning. <laughs> Beauty in the Breakdown represents the importance of trust and self-discovery through an unstable lifestyle, told through the eyes of Josh Ray, someone who believes that there is always something beautiful in a breakdown. And this book is about broken people for broken people which is like a little tagline that I got as a comment on the story when it was still published online. One of the main things I wanted to focus on was telling the stories of people who didn't fit into like, society's expectations, like contemplating like depression, anxiety, there's suicide. Not graphically, but it's talked about and discussed. The title of the book comes from a song under the same name by a band called Xenesthetic, which I fell in love with after hearing it for the first time. The inspiration from this novel came from like endless hours of analysing song lyrics, music videos and researching films. All this inspiration was put into words and then into the story. The idea of Bonnie and Clyde was like kind of important during the first chapters but from then onwards the story was driven by this like uncontrollable desire to create something new. I started writing this book in October 2014 The exact date was Thursday 23rd of October, which is also the date this book starts on. But after maybe, was it maybe a year, maybe a few months of writing, I took a break. Because I felt like I was rushing the story so much that it was quite imperfect. And as a perfectionist, I knew I needed to take time off to like edit and rewrite what I got to so far. Then I officially began writing again in December 2015, and the novel was completed August 2016. So the entire writing process took between, you could say, the one year, or the eight months from December to August, or like the close to two years from the October to August. And having something which has existed solely in my head and in Word documents for the past two years, as something physical which I can share with the world, is actually unbelievable. Thank you to everyone, friends, family, the people in the fellows, because you are my biggest supporters. Thank you for buying my book, giving me feedback, just like being great people. And I can't wait to see what else there is to come. Thank you and I will see you next week. Bye.